New Jersey was the first to take the hit of this nor'easter, and it's under a state of emergency now. Some parts have already got half of the two feet of snow predicted. This storm, as Joe mentioned, could be the worst to hit this area in seven years. Alyssa Coleman is live now in East Brunswick with the latest. Alyssa. Mary, as you can see, it is coming down pretty hard. The roads are extremely slippery. Officials tonight are warning people not to drive, if, if at all possible. And they're saying if you do have to drive, take it slow, even if you have a four-wheel drive vehicle. Governor Jim McGreevy declared a state of emergency for New Jersey. Officials say this is by far the worst storm of the season and may turn out to be as bad as the blizzard of 96. The storm has already clobbered the southern part of the state with snow falling at a rate of an inch an hour in some places, and it's been moving steadily north. When all is said and done, our area could see a foot and a half of snow. So we're asking people to get off the roads and get off the roads now. It's imperative not only for their safety, but also the safety of workers and the safety of roadways. Some 2,000 plows and salt spreaders are being put to use across New Jersey. Dale officials warn the combination of cold temperatures and snow make for treacherous driving conditions. It's not going to turn to slush as, as fast as it usually does. And uh, no matter how much we salt and plow, there are chances where there could be some dangerous patches on the road. <laughs> In anticipation of being homebound, shoppers rushed out to pick up last-minute essentials. For some, that meant buying shovels and salt. For others, it meant waiting on long lines at the supermarket. I want to at least have the necessities that I need, at least for breakfast and dinner tomorrow, in case I can't drive. Some milk, but they are out of milk. Yeah. Yep, and a lot of bread. They're out of milk? Yep. Well, definitely, what's our most important thing? Hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. We haven't had hot chocolate for the past two snowstorms, and we're going to have hot chocolate for this snowstorm. And I could certainly use a little bit of hot chocolate right now myself. Now, officials say there have already been at least two dozen accidents throughout New Jersey so far since the snow hit, and they say it probably would have been much worse if this was a weekday. They're also advising people if you get stuck or you see a driver stranded, you can call pound 95 for help. We're live in East Brunswick. Alyssa Coleman, WB11 News at 10. Peter, back to you. All right, Alyssa, got the hot chocolate brewing for you right here on the set. Okay, All right, what about the airports? If you're trying to fly out of town or expecting someone flying in 